Jeez. And then you can find out all about it at BrightSideBend.com, or you can call the Brightside Bend phone team at 866-735-2470. Okay, we're going to continue talking about arginine and the liver. Arginine is important for lots of things, but we're going to talk about how it's important for the liver. And it turns out that arginine is also important for cholesterol metabolism. There's a lot of literature that shows that you can lower your dose of statin drugs or maybe even completely eliminate your statin drugs by using arginine supplements. And when I talk about supplementing with arginine, I'm talking about one to five grams of arginine a day. You can buy arginine in capsules or in tablets. Personally, I like arginine powder. It does taste pretty lousy. Those four nitrogens make it very, very alkaloid or basic or uh, just nasty tasting. If you're a chemist, it's because of the, the, the alkalinity of the arginine, but you don't have to be a chemist to know this stuff tastes lousy. So if you're going to put it in your smoothie, you don't want to put too much in your smoothie because it will make your smoothie taste pretty, pretty bad. And you certainly don't want to, uh, don't want to use your arginine powder straight in water because it really does taste bad. But it is an amazing supplement and everybody who's interested in anti-aging or who's got wound healing issues wants to be using a little bit of arginine, one to five grams a day. Arginine, by the way, can be used topically, and we'll talk about that either tomorrow or the next day. We'll talk about how you can use arginine topically. I've been putting arginine in my glycolic acid formulations for many years. It turns out that arginine can actually have a very beneficial effect on the skin, and it can help improve the effects of alpha-hydroxy acids on the skin. Alpha-hydroxy acids like glycolic acid are well known for stimulating collagen production. Arginine is a is a youth-promoting and, and bodybuilding supplement, so it should come as no surprise that by mixing a little arginine with your alpha-hydroxy acids, you can improve the skin health benefits associated with alpha-hydroxy acids like glycolic acid and lactic acid, which can be very, very helpful for improving photo damage and improving uh, uh, the softness and smoothness of skin and just making your skin look better. We'll talk about that here in the next few days as we continue discussing the health benefits with, of super amino acid, which is what I call arginine. Okay, 855-660-4261 is our number. Let's go to Alabama and welcome Julie to the Bright Side. What's going on? Julie, how are you doing this morning? Hey there. I've been hey. listening to you since I heard you on Alex Jones talking about epigenetics. It was very interesting, and I've learned a lot from you. Awesome. And um, about four years ago, I was diagnosed with uh, rheumatoid arthritis in my hips, and I haven't been to the doctor since because I knew people around here get their joints changed like you change a light bulb, and I did not want to go down that route. Are you talking about, like, replacement surgery, knee replacement? Or oh, replacement? yeah. Oh, uh-huh. yeah. Uh-huh. They love so doing I that. I didn't want to do that. Like, oh, you, know, yeah. you know, Alabama is like Alabama is like ground zero for the medical model. You know that, right? That's where the medical model is born and raised practically. All the hospitals and insurance companies, lots of hospitals and insurance companies and, and surgical centers are, are located in Alabama. Where in Alabama are you, by the way? Huntsville. Oh, that's it. That's the, that's the epicenter, Huntsville, Alabama. Oh, I believe it. I believe it for everybody I know. Every family seems like when they get to my age, they have something replaced. Anyway, what, how old are you? I'm 54. 54? Yep. Okay. Well, you don't need to have, unless you got uh, unless you're in really really bad shape. You don't need a knee replacement or a hip replacement. You need good nutrition, in my opinion. But what's going right. on? Tell me. Tell me what's going on in right. your body. Okay. So I started on this quest to find a, a cure for myself, and so uh, I, you know the first thing I learned was my, my pH. But, oh, I've got to have a pH. I gave up Cokes. And then I, I got um, something called cell food, which caused me to detox, and that was good. And then, um, and then um, I was getting worse, though, until where I haven't been able to sleep in a bed for about two years. And last year, I was desperate. I was packing my chip and thigh and ice packs to try to be able to go to sleep. See, oh, wow. I was just very stubborn about not taking medicine. And so I decided to give up gluten. And I can't believe how much it helped me. That's I amazing. mean, total freedom of movement, total really, almost no pain. It's been a stunning. Now, what okay. do you mean? Say you gave up gluten. Tell me specifically, like what kind of foods did you give up? Bread, okay. pastas, anything that, as far as I know, has gluten. So you don't know necessarily it was gluten. You're just saying you got off the refined carbohydrates, is what you're telling me, right? Yes. Which okay. is one I, which is part of my question to you. Okay. okay? Um, I still sometimes have some stiffness, which makes me think I'm picking up something similar besides the gluten. And I have read that there are things in wheat that 
can cause problem, not necessarily the, the glute. That's absolutely so, correct. Okay, so I wanted from you for some suggestions okay. about how to better refine what I'm eating to That's see if I can great question. narrow it down. You raised so many good points there, it's hard to even know where to begin. But the first thing I think of from your story, Julie, and you, you touched on this, is, and I say this a lot on the program, it's not just gluten. Please do not allow the medical model or anybody really to simplify or, or uh, it, it really infantilize this idea. Make us feel like, you know, infantilization is this idea where we're treated like babies. We're treated like infants. They'll come up with one phrase or one kind of catch, low protein or high protein or low carb or paleo. Some people talk about paleo and now they're talking about gluten free. These are cliches. And health should not be about cliches. Health should be about real science and individuality, too. You know, when it comes to uh, food intolerances, it's, it's not just gluten. It's how we respond as individuals to specific foods. This is what we want to focus on. Not gluten-free, not keto, not or, uh, paleo, not low-carb, high-carb. How we as individuals respond to the specific foods we eat. That's so why I'm always focusing on doing a food diary, on writing down everything you eat, and then writing down next to, uh, in, in the columns, next to where you put uh, what you've eaten, how you'd feel from a digestive si- system uh, perspective. So you get a piece of paper, you get a notebook, and you uh, take the piece of paper and you divide it up into columns. The first column, you put everything you eat. And I mean everything, and it helps if you eat very simply, like you just eat one type of food. And then in the column next to where you write the food you ate, you write how you feel in two hours. And then in another column, how you feel in four hours. And then in another column in six hours and eight hours, even up to 10 to 12 hours. And then you notice the trends, how you're feeling every few hours compared to each food. Hang on. Let me finish this when we come back from our break, Julie. I'm Farmers. This band got lines open for you. 855-660-4261 is our number. We'll be back after this. Hi, I'm Dr. Joel Wallach, veterinarian and naturopathic physician. The Dead Doctors Don't Lie guy with an important message. Take charge of your health. Do not continue to blindly follow the system that has failed us all. I appreciate GCN listeners because you're open-minded and intelligent. If our system is so great, why is it that the United States, the USA, ranks nearly 60th worldwide in longevity and number one in obesity? All the while, we spend more money than all the other countries combined annually on unnecessary health care procedures and toxic drugs. It doesn't take much to get on track, not with the government or pharmaceutical companies, but rather you in control of your own health with a basic understanding of nutrition and supplementation. FDI Longevity has the finest quality health, sports, and energy supplements available. GCN listeners are invited to join our team of people who want to stay healthy well into old age. We are currently looking for specialists to represent FDI Longevity and save America. To buy products at wholesale prices or join our business team, go to GCNteam.com. That's GCNteam.com. Support GCN. Get healthy. So we decided to upgrade the look of our home. You know, improve the curve appeal. We decided to add the look of stone to the exterior. We really like the stacked stone look. Yeah, but when I checked into the price, it was ridiculous. No way could we afford it. Then a friend told me about Genstone. G-E-N-S-T-O-N-E. Genstone comes in lightweight panels made of polyurethane. They've actually engineered the hassle out of installation. No mortar, no mesh. It was easy. Even I could do it. We just screwed the panels to the wall and it looks like stone. Stone. I mean, it really looks like stone. Yeah, from the box to the wall in minutes. We love the look of our home now. And Genstone is durable, comes with a 25-year warranty, and offers additional R-value for insulation. If you want the look of stone at a price you can afford, call Genstone. At 855-955-STONE. Trust me, you'll save money. And you'll love the look. 855-955-STONE. That's 855-955-7866. Moms of America, stand up and stop taking abuse from your kids. I pledge never to let my kid disrespect me ever again. I pledge to stop letting my daughter walk all over me. I pledge to stop living in fear of my son's anger. I pledge never to feel like a bad parent ever again. Because I'm not. I pledge to stop letting my child's behavior control my home. I pledge to be a mom with kids who listen. 
a Total Transformation Mom. I'm Janet Lehman, co-creator of the Total Transformation Program. We created the Total Transformation to help parents with difficult child behavior. Now, I'm giving it away free. All you need to do is get the program and let us know how it works for you. We'll let you keep it for free. Call 1-800-256-7795. That's 1-800-256-7795. Call now. Call 1-800-256-7795. That's 1-800-256-7795. At 30dayfoodsupply.com, you can now purchase a -a one-of-a-kind product not available anywhere else, a meatless burger dry mix in four delicious flavors. With our new Oregon Trail Foods vegan burgers, all you do is add water and fry. They need no refrigeration. They're packaged in Mylar bags with an oxygen absorber for a long shelf life. They're non-GMO. They're gluten, soy, nut, and chemical-free, but they're loaded with flavor and a good source of carbs and protein, yet low in sodium. Flavors include Italian, spicy Mexican, Mexican, six vegetable and black bean olive. Go to 30dayfoodsupply.com or call 541-229-0010 and order today. Eat them every day. Take them camping or save them for an emergency. Check them out at 30dayfoodsupply.com and click on the vegan burger icon. That's 30dayfoodsupply.com where all of our products are produced in Oregon by Oregon Trail Foods. 30dayfoodsupply.com. Free from the shackles of corporate America, we're the place for independent thinkers. GCN. Okay, we are back on the bright side. 855-660-4261 is our number. We got Julie in Alabama. We're talking about arthritis. Uh, Julie, let me ask you a couple questions, okay? Julie? Uh, First of all, arthritis is kind of like a secondary symptom. It's not a primary symptom. It's a a symptom that follows the basic breakdowns in the body. So step number one, got any digestive issues you can think of? I used to. Okay. um, Probiotics. And um, I, I could credit that mostly for, oh, and also I use a calcium bitmite clay. seems to also have helped me. Well, hang on. Um, I, you know, I, I want to get to the, ha, hang on, hang on. Did you say you had hemorrhoids or you have a history of hemorrhoids? I used to. Mm-hmm. Okay. Or all your digest when you stopped eating the gluten, you said you still had a few, a few things going on, though, didn't you? Yeah. Uh-huh. Oh, so, like, digestive issues, I assume, correct? You um, still feel- I, I noticed a... De- if I get a meal I know has gluten, I definitely no. no aside like from the gluten, gluten, what I'm trying to I'm trying to nail down is: Do you still have digestive issues aside from the gluten intolerance? If from I the, no, no, it's just gluten. I am behaving, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you're behaving. Okay, good. All right. Well, you you understand the link then between foods and your symptoms, and that's great. But your point was very interesting though before we went to our break, and that was that it's other thi- there are other things aside from gluten, and, and that's what I was trying to I was trying to talk about before we went to the break is that we get we get all go off on these cliches, and I hear people tell me all the time, well I'm gluten free or I'm eating paleo or I'm low carb. These are cliches, and they have no business in the world of health. You got to focus on how you are feeling yourself. If you still have arthritis symptoms and you're so called gluten free, there's other things going on. On. I would say that there's probably other digestive things going on, and that's why you want to focus on digestive health and you want to link your symptomology, your digestive symptomology, to your other bodily symptoms. But aside from that, you can just go, just cut to the chase and go into some digestive support. Probiotics are the must have go to digestive supplement. When I say probiotics, I'm not just talking about supplements. I'm also talking about fermented foods. As far as supplements go, the BioLumin Nightly Essence from Longevity, you can find that on my website, brightsideben.com. As you know, if you've listened to this program, I think it's the best, absolute, finest probiotic supplement I've ever seen, and I've seen a lot of them. You know, one of the reasons I say that is because not only does it have multiple strains of bacteria, not only does it have lots of bacteria, lots of probiotic, uh, lots of uh, probiotic bacteria, but it also has enzymes in it, and enzymes have multiple benefits. So you're going to get your probiotics. You're going to help stabilize and replace the missing bacteria in the microbiome, the universe of bacteria in the gut. But you also get the benefits of the enzymes, and the enzymes can 
not only help you digest your food, but they can also help you with inflammation. They can also help you with blood thinning. They can also help you with pain. This is, these are, this is the neatest thing about digestive enzymes is they will dissolve protein clots in the blood, protein clots that can cause inflammatory pain. If you have arthritis post-surgery, or pre-surgery, they can help you recover from, from surgical procedures much, much faster. So the reason I like the Biolumin Nightly Essence so well is because you're getting all these enzymes in addition to the probiotics. So if you're going to use 